Would you eat raw liver like the liver king? Let's eat a beef liver bison burger. But first consider checking out my spread shop. I got two new designs, check them out. All right, we're gonna start with the ground bison and beef liver. This is 100% ground bison. It's a 90-10 ratio. So 90% lean, 10% fat. So I'm just gonna tear the corner here and just kind of squeeze it out. I only need enough for one burger. <laughs> there you go, that should be enough. This is the liver and it's full of blood and liquid. I'm gonna actually go inside and just take one slice and just wash it and bring it back out. All right, I'm back and I have a whole piece of liver like this. So I'm gonna get the beef liver and mix it up with the uh, bison meat. And I'm gonna crack an egg in it. No, just mix. All right, the egg kind of loosened it up way too much. So I'm gonna add more bison meat and liver. All right, I added more meat. Let's add seasoning. I'm gonna add garlic powder. There you go. And a nice dash of MSG. And you can't go wrong with some Dano's hot chipotle. It's always low sodium. This is my favorite pairing with some meat. There you go. Perfect. Now, get in there, mix everything up. All right. Just like that, perfect. I'm gonna press it down so it's a little flatter. I'm gonna cook this in a air fryer and this is probably going to shrink. And so that's why I want it to be a little thinner like this. So it'll cook a little bit better and it'll fit the, the bun a little bit better later. I'm gonna go like this. There we go. We'll, we'll set this in the air fryer like this. All right, so I'm gonna be working with the Bluetti power station again. This thing is so cool. I can run the air fryer off of this. I had a previous battery pack thing also, and it didn't work. But this, the Bluetti power station here, this, this is called the AC200 Max. This thing is the coolest thing ever. So you just turn it on right here, like that. A screen turns on. This, you can just plug it in to an outlet right here, like that. And then you turn the AC on like that. And that beep was the sound of the air fryer. There you go. I'm gonna place the patty in like that. I'm gonna cook at 370 for like 10 minutes. That should be good. If not, I'll cook it longer. See, this is a fully contained off-grid power station. Oh, you can see smoke coming out already <laughs> but yeah this thing is so cool all right i am going to move this though over here i'm gonna wash my knife and i'm gonna prepare the onions tomatoes and lettuce <laughs> let's get the tomato Ah, perfect. <laughs> Actually, this one's better. <laughs> okay. Yep, it's incredibly juicy. <laughs> this is perfect. All right, time to build the burger. Danos. All right. <laughs> Here you go. Here is everything. It looks perfect. Oh. <laughs> oh my god, it's so good. This is a perfect combination of everything. Hmm.
So you can taste the liver, but it's really, really subtle. I don't mind the taste of liver. Mm, it's really good. Mmm. So good. There's one thing missing though, and it's pickles. Forgot to add it, so I'm gonna go grab it now. These are the best kind of pickles too. There we go. Mm, look at them. <laughs> Perfect. The burger is so much better now. Mm. So the additional acidity from the pickles balances everything out. This is so good. Last bite. <laughs> Mm, that was amazing. <laughs> oh, I got some bottles of Mountain Dew with me. I've been using these bottles as props <laughs> for my videos for Mountain Dew. You guys will see it later. I can't talk too much about it yet. That hit the spot. Oh, perfect. <clears throat> yep, that was my dinner. I look forward to when I'm able to catch like a catfish or a pike or walleye or something. All of the, all my friends and people that I know have been catching fish, but me. I've been going everywhere. I've been going to lakes, rivers, small ponds and stuff like that. I haven't been able to catch anything. Nothing substantial, at least. I caught one, like, sunfish a while back. I ended up just tossing it back, like, three days later. Like, it was still alive in my cooler three days later. And so I just drove it back to the same lake, and I just tossed it back in. But yeah, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Smash that like button, consider subscribing, and check out my Discord server. I usually try to respond on there, and then it's just a community there. And uh, I'm trying to build a place where people can go and just discuss a bunch of different topics. Otherwise, I have two new designs. I have a Raven design. It's like a headshot of her with like a really big collar. And then the second design is a soft shell crab design. It's really cute. <laughs> um, and I'm gonna be getting like shirts, I think, for them. And uh, I'm gonna, and then I'm gonna continue promoting it. I'm gonna eat the, I'm gonna eat soft shell crabs with the soft shell crab shirt on. It would be really cool. Otherwise, all of the merch that I sell on my spread shop, all of that is gonna go towards Raven's ACL surgery starting in, on June 1st. And so it's a couple weeks away and I'm somewhat nervous. There's really no point in worrying right now. And I'm just gonna have confidence in the surgeon and the doctor and then kind of go from there. But I plan on getting more designs out also. I have this idea for a design for like morels it's not an original idea to be honest it's gonna be uh morel support sort of like moral support but it's just gonna be like a picture of like some morel mushrooms and then there's probably gonna be like text bubbles that come out that say like a bunch of supportive words or things you know around the morel mushroom it's gonna be cool uh and it's gonna be like probably a one month sort of campaign or something for that and then i plan on doing other stuff too it's gonna be really cool and the raven plush that is still in the works i haven't gotten a response back from their design team and so so yeah i'll update everyone once i get a response from them <laughs> but yeah that's it for today i'll see you next time peace out